change in the instructions so that our iPad cases would look better. And what I've decided is once you get your iPad case put together and you've sewed the top pieces like this so that they're nice and stitched down, you're going to assemble your iPad case like it's going to look when it's done. And then we're going to sew the two long sides at a fourth of an inch right along the edge using the presser foot as our seam allowance. Got to get some as you go. You want to make sure your tab is way out of the way so that you don't catch it. And when you get up here to the top, I want you to back stitch because I, the top is going to get an awful lot of stress on it. So we're going to do that. And then once we do that, we're going to turn it inside out. Okay? 